this video is about review for topic one. In this question, give all answers correct to two decimal places. Use a compound interest formula and a TVM solver. Mia deposits $4,500 into a bank account. The bank pays a nominal annual interest rate of 6% compounded semi-annually. Find the amount of interest that Mia will earn over the next 2.5 years. First of all, let's use a compound interest formula. The interest equals future value minus present value. We will use uh, this formula to work out uh, future value over the next uh, 2.5 years. K is the number of uh, compounding period uh, per year. Semi-annually means uh, K equals 2. We are given present value. N is the number of years. 2.5. R percent is a nominal annual rate of interest. R equals 6. R percent, this means 6 over 100. F of Z equals 4,500 times 1 plus. 6 over 100 times 2, then 2 times 2.5. Go to 4,500, parentheses, 1 plus alpha y equals 6 over 100 times 2. Then parentheses back, upper level, power, 2 times 2.5, enter. Then we subtract 4,500 to get the interest. $716.73. Let's review TVM solver. Capital N means the number of compounding periods equals N times K. N is the number of years. K is the number of compounding periods per year. Annually, k equals 1. Half yearly, n equals 2. Quarterly, n equals 4. Monthly, n equals 12. I percent uh, means uh, nominal annual interest rate as a percentage. Interest is always uh, positive. Appreciation rate is a positive. Depreciation rate is a negative. PV means a principal or present value. PV is a positive if you receive money. PV is a negative if you take the money out of your pocket. PMT means amount of for each regular payment. FV means a future value. FV is a positive if you receive money. FV is negative if you take the money out of your pocket. Normally, the sign of a PV and a FV are opposite. Payment per year. It's related to PMT, compounding periods per year, equals payment per year.
this uh, compounding periods per year is uh, related uh, to this uh, K. In other words, it's uh, related uh, to this uh, capital N number of uh, compounding periods. In this situation, we go to apps, finance, enter, TVM solver, enter. This N is a 2.5 times 2. Interest is a 6. PV is a $4,500. You took it out of your pocket. It's a negative. In this question, no payment, so we put zero. Future value we are looking for, so still put zero. Payment per year is uh, two. Compounding period is uh, two. We put the cursor back to future value. Alpha enter solve. We get the same answer. By TVM solver, just write down whatever you have uh, in TVM solver. So, interest equals 5216.73 minus 4500 equals $716.73. Ellen also deposits into a bank account. Her bank pays a nominal annual interest rate is 4%, compounded monthly. In 2.5 years, the total amount in her account will be 4,500. Find the amount that Alan deposits in the bank account. We will use compound interest formula first. Future value equals $4,500. We are looking for PV. R equals uh, 4, K equals uh, 12 because it's uh, monthly, N equals 2.5, 4,500 equals PV times 1 plus 4 over 400 times uh, 12 to the 2.5 times 12. We will use the uh, equation solver to solve this uh, PV. Make uh, equation equal to zero first. Minus uh, 4,500 both sides. Zero equals PV. One plus four over 100 times 12 to the 2.5 to the 2.5 times 12 minus 4500 since this equation is very complicated we need to go to y1 first x for pv 1 plus alpha y equals 4 over 100 times 12 power 2.5 times 12 minus 4,500. Math, upper arrow, solver. Alpha trace, go to Y1, put a 10, then alpha enter. $4,072.45 by solver PV equals $4,072.45. Let's use the TVM solver to solve this uh, problem. Apps, finance, solver, N equals 2.5 times 12 
interest uh, is a four percent. Present value is something we are looking for. Nothing to deal with the uh, PMT. Future value is uh, forty five hundred. Payment per year. Let's put the twelve. Compound period per year, 12. Then go back to PV. Alpha, enter. Answer is a negative $4,072.45. It's the amount that Ellen deposits in the bank account.